Ukraine is also playing a huge role in American domestic policy. Do you think Biden is holding back military support? So just before his election in November 2024, he can come out like a big winner? Do you think well, let's, let, let, let's look at look at the facts. He is holding back support. OK, there's enough shit in the desert that you could arm the, the Ukrainian army uh, three times over, lose it all and put more put more there. OK, they've got guns. They've got uh, M1 tank, they've got the lot, M1 Bradley, sorry, they've got the lot in the desert. They've got A-10 aircraft. They're just about to to, to um, take out of service. So there's lots and lots of stuff that they could actually give Ukraine that would make a fundamental difference. That's the first. That's a fact. OK, now what isn't a fact and what isn't clear is the reason why. And the reason why it, it may be elections. It may be elections. It may also be that someone in the White House, including Biden himself, is bought. OK, it could, it, you know, we don't know this, but but they are delaying. The White House is delaying. It could well be just straightforward um, fear, fear that, that, that Russia actually means what it says about going nuclear. Now, maybe, maybe, maybe Biden has got uh, intelligence uh, that we don't know about. Uh, that he's he's holding back on something um, that get, makes him make a, a different decision. The, the, the fact of the matter is we don't know. We only know the fact that he is delaying. That's the, that's the only thing we know. The rest of it is conjecture. Well, and, that's... And, and I don't know which. I don't know which. But I, I, I worry that it may be that him or some of his team are bought. And if before anybody says that that's nonsense, hey, it's not. Look at the whole of Europe. We know that politicians all across Europe have been bought. Um, yeah. It's a rare country where the, the, it's a rare country where they haven't, or where someone is not uh, trying to undermine the support for Ukraine. Uh, a rare country, um, and increasingly we're seeing more countries, more politicians coming out on the on the pro side, which means that the FSB has been doing its work a lot lot better than we even dared dream about. Well, they've been Probably doing it longer, too. I mean, long, longer than we did dream. Yeah. I mean, we now know that this has been going on from back in the 90s. I knew that anyway, because the defense attache in, in, in Finland told me um, that, that, you know, the Russian defense attache. So so <laughs> it's it's a fa that's that's one of the reasons why I've been so positive about knowing what was going to happen was because I was told in black and white terms that this, you know, this was coming this was coming